Welcome everybody to our latest video on the rail cars of the Austin Steam Train Association. Our train has a variety of cars, from coach cars to lounge cars, but the most unique car that everybody on the train wants to see is our concession car, the Cedar Park. You can get drinks, snacks, and souvenirs. So why don't we get on board and have a look? I'm Steve Hansen. I've been a volunteer with the Austin Steam Train Association since 1999. You're one in one of our most unique cars, the Cedar Park. It was built in 1946 as part of a 14 car order for the Santa Fe Railroad. It was originally built as a coach car. As you can see, there are no coach seats in it. It was also the last of the pre-war designs that Bud built for any railroad. After that, designs changed. In addition to things like t-shirts and scarves and whatnot. One of the things that I'm proudest of is the book Along the Granite and the Iron Route. It is your guidebook to your experience on board the train. It includes a map of the route. It includes information about the little towns that the railroad went through, how it was rail was constructed. And there's a two page spread of color photos for wildflowers. It's a great value available only in the concession car, the Cedar Park car, on the Austin Steam Train runs. Hill Country Flyer, Bertram Flyer, come visit us and get your copy of this book. So our Cedar Park car ran on the San Diegan, which is a route that was run by the Santa Fe Railroad between Los Angeles and San Diego, California. It ran from 1946 until 1959. An exciting event happened in 1958. On November the 19th, an F4D Skyray airplane overshot the runway in El Toro and was struck by the San Diegan going 75 miles an hour. Three locomotives and seven cars derailed, including at least one of the Cedar Park's car's sister. We don't know for sure, but it is possible that the Cedar Park was on that train. Fortunately, there were no fatalities or serious injuries. So in 1971, Santa Fe sold these cars to Amtrak which kept them in service for a number of years. But ultimately they did replace them and it was purchased by a private individual. He wanted to turn it into an office and had no need for the chairs. This made the car perfect for us to use as a concession car. We purchased the car in 2013, but it still needed some work. So beginning in 2015, our volunteers worked very hard on doing a restoration of the car, complete with rewiring and custom furniture. Volunteers such as Benny Kirk, Jack Pearson, and Rich Wise, and many others helped in this project, which has made life on board the train much more pleasant and fun for all our passengers. So come see us in the concession car. So I hope you've enjoyed your visit in our special concession car, the Cedar Park. And we couldn't do the trains without volunteers. If you want to find out about volunteering, go to our website austinsteamtrain.org and it, hope you'll look at our other videos including this one right here which is about the restoration of our steam locomotive southern pacific 786 thanks for watching our video